We've talked about the bar we set to be considered a basic distributed SQL database. Scale, consistency, resiliency, and SQL with ACID transactions, all of it native and all of it baked into the architecture so that it happens smoothly. CockroachDB checks off every box and goes even further. First, CockroachDB only uses serializable isolation, the highest level possible. Even many legacy SQL databases don't offer this. I don't have time to do the topic justice right now, but this means that every transaction behaved as if it had exclusive use of the entire cluster from start to finish. We said CockroachDB speaks SQL, but not just that, it uses the open source PostgreSQL wire protocol, tapping into a mature existing ecosystem of drivers and ORMs that developers have relied upon for years. We already said that the database should be distributed, but in many cases there are legal restrictions that require data to never leave a certain region. Let's add georeplication, a general term for the ability to control where your data resides in a globally distributed cluster, to that requirement. Even if there are no legal concerns, you still shouldn't need to send a query halfway around the world when some of your nodes are sitting in a data center one city over. CockroachDB delivers this with its features that allow users to peg data to a particular locality. Additionally, a true distributed SQL database should be multi-cloud, meaning it shouldn't be tied to a specific cloud provider. Spanner might be a basic distributed SQL database, but if you use it, you're locked into Google Cloud. Your database should be able to run anywhere on any combination of bare metal servers or cloud instances from multiple providers and to do so seamlessly. CockroachDB doesn't care where it's running. A node is a node and any node that joins a cluster will work. Finally, CockroachDB provides administration tools, both on the command line and with a graphical interface. It offers optimization tools, such as our cost-based query optimizer, and baked-in security, including user authentication, authorization, audit logging, and encryption of your data, both on disk and over the wire. There's so much to cover, we won't be able to get to all of it in this Getting Started course. This is what you should expect from a true distributed SQL database, and this is why people are flocking to CockroachDB. Thank you.